Lubaba TV. Hello, welcome again, and this is another session, and today we are in a third episode in our subject, Business Pig Farming. And today, I want to share another thing which will be more profitable also to pig farmers. And I want to talk on things to consider before constructing a pig house. So you'll be in a good position to know which are the important things you should take care of or you should consider when you just want to think of building a strong and recommended pig farm so let's go together and if you have not yet subscribed consider subscribing and hit the bell so as to be updated whenever we put new updates but also share to your friend and family so as they can also reign and get some knowledge that we provide here at Lubaba TV it's clear that in order your pig to be healthy and be productive, they must be kept in a good house. That means that a good housing has a high fat percentage in contributing the health and the, the sustainability of your pig farming project. But also, people might be wondering that when you want to, to build or to construct a best pig farm, I mean pig house, you must be having a lot of money. No, that's not true and that's not correct. What is needed is just to choose a proper design but also use some different techniques which I will talk on them today. So let us proceed and go together. Hope you get something and you learn something which might help you before you start constructing. First thing you should know and you should consider that try to construct and housing which is in your capability meaning that you the materials which are in your affordability don't try to impress people just try to look on your money or your, on your pocket because it's bad to start something and end up without finishing it that means that when you start to construct a pig housing which you might use a lot of money you will end up just thinking farming is not a profitable thing so just try to use materials and a design which probably you can afford so that is one among the first and important thing you should consider another thing you should consider is the size of your project this is a very important thing some people starting a certain project and they are aiming to reach far but they still having worries so they end up in building small, small pig housing and they just being forced to add it after a few days. And that just makes them to end up in using a lot of money. So when you want to construct, also it's very important to see and look what is the size of your project. This will help in reducing the cost which might be on, uh, incurred when you want to add your housing. And another thing which I might say is that use cheap and easy accessible materials. Don't for things, don't just look in a TV and you just saw somebody has built by using some blocks and you want to force using blocks while the blocks in your area are very costful and they are difficult to get them. Just use the local materials which I mean the materials which are locally available with the cheap prices. If you can use timber, just use. If you can use bricks, just use. If you can use anything which you can use, just don't force because this will just make you end up in using a lot of money while just constructing a very small housing. And one important thing is just use an experienced mason in constructing your pig housing. Why I'm saying this? Not every mason can construct a quality pig housing. Don't just take an any mason because you end up in fighting with him. He can he or she can just end up in building another house or can end up in building a house, not a pig housing. 
can just end up in building a person house so try to use a person who is experienced in building or in constructing some pig housing this is because pig housing has some special construction or has some special things you should put or design different with with other house and another thing that makes sure you record all costing card during construction of your pig house because a good farmer is the one who keep records without keeping records you won't know what you're getting and what you're losing so make sure you do it and one another important thing that i have to say it even though many farmers doesn't doesn't want to understand it but hope you're not the one try to start a retro don't wait till you get enough money or the large amount of money then you start constructing your pig farming no get to know that little by little fill up the measure let's end up here and hope you have got another thing which you didn't know or you didn't have before and thank you for listening this is manu baba and this is baba tv